what if you actually started to take a proactive stance when it comes to managing your healthcare, just like you manage your P&L in your business, just like you manage your home finances, just like you manage so many other parts of your life. It's one of the bigger expenses a company has. Next to maybe your payroll and materials for your jobs, it is way up there and it should be looked at very, very carefully every year. You fell straight into that, that basket of, oh, we'll come in with a 14% increase and then we'll look like heroes when we come in with six or eight, pat me on the back and take your 8% increase. And, and the math just doesn't work as we know. And it just gets one of these things that just can't go on. And so we decided a couple of years ago, and frankly speaking, we probably wouldn't have decided if it wasn't for John coming to us and, and opening our eyes. As an HR administrator, you're there to keep your costs down for the company and also to get the best benefits you can for the employees. And we spoke at length to the owners. We had multiple meetings and we decided to give it a try. I cannot tell you the amount of money we have saved, both the employees and the company. It's huge. It's just huge. Does it make sense? It absolutely makes sense. I mean, who can argue with that? It's more flexibility. There's more taking control of your own future. At the end of the day, it works.